do you ever buy something or a lot of some things and then realise you have absolutely no storage space left and no idea where they're all going to go? Hello again, welcome back. I'm Angela from artarai.co.uk and this is just another short video just showcasing some more things that I've bought. It's not exactly a haul video because I think if you have a haul all of the things that you buy from the, the same place. But I've bought a few different things from a few different places and I can't wait to show you them. So the smallest one that I've bought I'm actually going to leave till last because it, act it actually complements the best one that I bought. You'll see what I mean when I'm finished. So I went onto eBay just looking for stamps and I came across this seller who was selling loads and loads and loads of stamps. Some admittedly imperfect as they said in the listing but I can't believe I got these for I think they were £8.50 for just so many stamps. I haven't even had a look at them all yet. I just had a look to make sure that they were in. So I'm just going to have a look and see what we have here. What's that? Oh, a little free gift. Isn't that cute? To say thank you. You can never have enough gems and decorations in my book. So let me see what we have here. I had no idea to put a little stamping is that a stamping little stamping platform i had no idea that they were going to include one of those that is just so cute that has made my day that so those are all the stamps. I am absolutely over them and I can't believe I got those, all of them, for £8.50 on eBay. If you are looking for new stamps, new inks, new, well, secondhand even, anything, always shop around. You could ask on FreeCycle, like Recycle websites. You could go to your local charity shop. Just before you pay a fortune buying anything new, like I have done over the past year or so, get look for a bargain like that because you absolutely can't beat it. I think that's just amazing. Now, this is the one I was most excited for. This was £30, around £30 from... Um, Hobbycraft? What am I like? I meant to bring in the, the receipt so you could see, but never mind. In here, oh, it's just absolutely gorgeous. Hobbycraft, yes it is. So what it is, it's a mixed media art set. So I've been wanting to do a video about mixed media, but I, all I had were inks and pens, which is, yes, it is mixed media, but I wanted to really branch out. So there are colouring pencils, there are watercolour pencils, and if you lift these up, Oh, look at all of those. There are watercolours, there are pastels, there are oils, there are acrylics. You've got paint brushes, you've got little paint mixes and everything. I, I just I just think that it's absolutely I've been brilliant. I've been waiting for this for a few days now when I first saw it. 
So I really can't wait to get started with this. So I've been wanting, to, like I said, I've been wanting to do quite a bit of mixed media stuff, and it's more than what mixed media is more than what you just see here. But I just think this is just beautiful, and I couldn't resist it when I saw it. So for thirty pounds, and I mean, if you have something like this, then you probably would never need to use them if you're any good at art, or even if you're not good at art, there are. Um, techniques you can use to make cards, to make your own backgrounds, anything using your mixed media. So that will hopefully be my next big video. We'll be showing you how to make, how to use mixed media to make cards and other things. Probably use those stamps as well. Um, regarding these stamps, I will. There are some. There are one or two there that I already have, and there are one or two that I know I won't use. So the ones that I won't use myself, I will put for sale on my website at artari.co.uk. If you check in the description below this video, you will see a code for 10% off for any purchase. Anybody, all of my YouTube visitors, anybody who watches my videos, all my subscribers, you can always get 10% off. And I do have a used section on my website in my store where I sell used tools, but they're all in excellent condition. Things like scoring boards, um, cutters, dies, just loads of things like that. So if you're interested in 10% off, just check the link below. For I'll give you a link to the store, direct link to the store, and the code for 10% off. And it's worldwide, I ship. So just go and have a look and see what you fancy. So I'll probably do that now to make sure that by the time this video comes out in the next few days, hopefully I'll have them listed on my store if you want to have a look at them. So I just wanted to show you this. It's This came with the, the mixed media set. Introduction to drawing and painting techniques. So I am really going to enjoy looking through these. I mean, I don't think I'll be able to, <laughs> to knock out anything as good as that. But... It's going to be a help. See, you could use any of these techniques for your card backgrounds or anything like that. So I will leave a link to this, to that set, in the description as well, just in case you're interested in having a look. Oh, oh I forgot something, didn't I? Yeah. This is my little purchase. You may wonder what on earth it is. So... <laughs> This is my little blower. So when you do mixed media, sometimes when you use oils or you use watercolours, you can sort of blow them around, blow the paint around or the ink or whatever you're using. And it just gives it a little bit of texture, just a little bit of interest. But you don't have to use one of these. You could just use a straw and blow it around yourself. Just don't get lightheaded when you do it. And I have this little, it's like a little ink stamp thingy like a blender, um, and you get loads and loads of different um, accessories with it. So you could change those. I'll just show you quickly. You've got your blending tool there. It already comes with an extra one. So what you can do when you're done is take off that like that. And obviously you can use another one. So if you have lots of different coloured inks that you want to use, it's no problem because you can just keep swapping and changing. You only really need one of these and you can just keep swapping and changing. So, for instance, I mean, they're just Velcro. Just put it on like that. And use it like that. So, yeah, that's great. You can get the thick ones as well. I do have a few of these also. But it's, it's really handy for your blending your inks and things like that. And then we've got the extra ones there, my little blowy thing. And I think these are just brushes. Look like blending brushes. Oh yeah, these are little brushes, blending brushes. So that's good. I shall also leave a link to this as well, just in case you're interested in buying anything like that. So that's my smallest one. And the reason I left this to the last is because I will be using all of this hopefully with my mixed media set because 
water colours and things like that you can water them down and blow them across your page and what have you so yes that's what I shall do so in the meantime thank you so much for staying with me I do love showing off my little shopping purchases so thank you for staying with me I really appreciate it and have a great day bye bye now